I will be the first to admit right now I'm 100% lost. I don't, okay, we're back here. Uh, I think that's the... Okay, yeah, I think that's the Carthaginian camp, so I don't think we want to go back that way. Can we go this way? This road leads to the mountains and back country. It crosses dry solitudes infested with the dragons of the sands. Don't go that way. Honestly, dude, you are the nicest guy I've met so far. I think this is... Is this the Carthaginian camp where... It, Oh wait, hold it, hammers. Is this like a, a smithy or something? Ah, slave. You dare come to my tent to steal from me, Authorite, chief of the Gallic mercenaries? I'll pound you into nothing less than a small cube. Matho has asked you to come to my home and steal my tools? Come on. Invent a lie that's more believable than that. All right. Well then, seeing as I've received the money that was owed and I'm in good spirits, Thank God. I'll give you a chance. We'll play a game of Katab. If you prove to be skilled, you will walk away from here with your miserable life. If you are inept, I'll personally deliver you to the Carthaginians. Ah, oh, fuck. One of those, one of these freaking mini-games. Let's see if we can... Yeah, have I ever told you I hate dogs? Uh, let's see if we can con him into taking the chainsaw. Ah, <laughs> but you'll have to. Your victory, if you beat me, will be all that much sweeter. So, we're not getting the chains off then. All right. Here are the rules of the game. Each player takes his turn and throws a helmet towards a shield, aiming for the middle. Grab a helmet and begin. Fuck. It's playing darts. Helmet, 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 helmet. There's the shield. Those helmets? Oh, okay. Not doing so hot. <laughs> Sucker. Oh, well, even game. Fuck. You lost this game, but you played well. In exchange, I'll spare your life. I'll be content with taking these fine metal chains on your wrists. Place your hands on the anvil so that I can remove them. Are you going to take the hands in the process too? Guess not. Well, that was um better than what I expected. Um Let's see if we can ask him about mending the statue. Just like talk to him or something. Don't forget that you now owe me. What, so we can't tell him about the statue? No? Fuck. Okay, well. Ah. <sighs> Plan B. Wander around <laughs> aimlessly again. Am 
Whoa, what? It's like the wall of H.R. Geiger. Who the fuck are you? Halt, stranger. Ah. You're approaching the village of the eaters of vile things. You mean like you? <laughs> okay, so yeah, let's find out more of these. We are pariahs. Carthage has rejected us, and we've come to live here in the shadows of the waterworks. And what is it that you eat? Because we believe that any flesh is to be eaten. That stinger probably went well with what everyone was thinking. Yeah, they eat people too. Now let's see how they get along with the works. We have nothing against them. On the other hand, we hate the Carthaginians. Can we go in? No, unless... Might you know how to capture pigs? Yeah, you cause a disturbance, they come running. Oh, sorry, different type of pigs. Uh, let's go for it. Worst that can happen is we die. You're surely not fast enough to catch a running pig. If you have nothing else to offer, be on your way. Uh, okay, so this could be safe refuge, but, um, obviously we need a pig. Well, actually, I just thought of something. The whole... The fact that they uh, believe that any flesh can be eaten. I wonder if that goes back to the whole thing and that a lot of Semitic peoples actually don't believe that uh, pork is actually, you know, is actually edible for humans. I think because, like, pretty much every, and like, almost every group of people in the Middle East has this disdain for pork. Um,. Oddly enough, though, the... You aren't allowed to leave the camp. That's an order from Matho. Oh, already. Um, yeah, but um, on the flip side, though, the Celts actually apparently had, like, practically a bacon god. Or a, you know, a, a god of pork. <laughs> hey, a bacon god sounds better. Am I going there? No? Actually, hang on. We need to be nimble to catch a pig. Can we borrow a map? Uh, over here, this, there was this... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, yeah, you know, there was an option where we could ask you about borrowing a mount. Can we do that? Certainly not. I am responsible for these animals, and I don't entrust them with just anyone who comes along. Eh, never mind then. Um, let's go talk, go back to talking with this dude here. Mr. Angsty Smith. <laughs> what would I do with you? I've received what I was owed, and as soon as the Carthaginians make ships available, I'll be off to Gaul. Yeah, would nothing convince you to stay here? Hmm. I sometimes think that the mercenaries could take Carthage if they only wanted to. The city would be at our mercy if we were to turn our weapons towards it. But I'm the only one to think like this. The other chiefs would not dare attack their erstwhile masters. Ooh. Are we going to incite a rebellion? I think we are. We're going to go incite a mercenary rebellion. I remember uh, Matho. Um, there was an option about protection with Matho. Let's go talk to him and see if we can do make like a similar one. Repair the statuette and show me. Uh, okay, never mind. Uh, any more advice from you? You aren't allowed to leave the. Okay, yeah, I, I know we're not allowed to leave the camp. Uh, 
da, 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 da. There's a big open road. Why can't we go that way? Da, 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 da. Uh, Was the stuff in here? Can, uh, can we not repair this stuff? Here, doggy, eat the statue. Eat it. Hmm. Actually, what? Any difference to our character? Not really, just same dopey hat, just different, uh... Actually, what happens if we ask this guy about the statue? Nothing? Nothing? Halt, straight. No! Uh, okay. Then you're up no- Okay. Bye! Back, ah. vermin, or I'll nail you to the ground! What? Never been nailed to the ground before. We're gonna die if we do this. Oh yeah, we're <laughs> we are dead. We're dead, dead. Back, vermin, or I'll nail you to the ground. Alrighty, so apparently that's the. Uh, running out of options. Oh wait, hey oh, I did not see this earlier. Geez, stingers at every corner. Who are you? Uh, friend, I have Reskin. a huge selection of pots and jugs. Are you interested? Uh, no, I think we. Or wait, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna make that joke. Are you a warrior or an artisan? I'm both, my friend. I'm a Gallic mercenary, but a warrior must keep himself busy in times of peace. <laughs> and you're the and you're another really nice person who I've met, finally. Uh yeah, let's see let's get some background. To fight against Rome, Carthage recruited mercenaries from all countries. The battle was a long one. We won great victories. But in the end, the Romans proved stronger, Roma, and peace Roma. was concluded to their advantage. Obliged to leave the lost territory, we came back here to camp out in front of Carthage while waiting to receive the money we were owed. Yeah, because mercenaries win no matter who, which side wins. Yes, finally. I was just at Hanan's tent, where I got my money. I was lucky to be one of the first to get paid. And what does Carthage need, mercenaries? Spying, intent, veil... <laughs> just very shadow of a veiled Carthage's intent Carthage's national army is not very big. In times of war, they must add foreign troops to it. This, honestly, this was actually a rather common practice, clean up until nationalized armies became a thing in like the 1700s, to tell you the truth. And even then, it was still common until... Actually, I think the 1800s was whenever the practice, for the most part, I wouldn't say ended, but really dropped off. We were originally camped inside the city, but Hanon made us leave to avoid disturbances, so he said. In fact, I think he's wary of us, as are many of his compatriots. Yeah, let's see if... He can do anything with the statue. Mm, this statuette is in poor shape. Use this fish glue. There's nothing better for fixing broken objects. Fish glue. <laughs> Kalima. Thanks a lot, dude. You are like, you're great. Honestly, between you and the dude guarding the, the road, you two are like the nicest people here. Oh, give him the fish glue. No, um, there That's you are. your face. Oh, Salambo. You've disrupted my dreams and haunted my sleepless nights. I saw you from afar. 
untouchable, like the heavenly body of Tanith. Now I know that you love me. Nothing will stop me from obtaining your hand in marriage. Cold shower, dude. Um, as a reward for protecting me from the slave hunters, it sounds a bit um too uh I don't know too begging. I well, let's offer our services rather. No, Spendius. You could have been useful to me during the war, but now that peace has returned, I have no need for your talents. Shall we try the begging approach then? I won't deliver you to the Carthaginians, but I won't do anything to hinder their search. I cannot make them angry. Not when I'm about to ask to marry the most beautiful woman of their city. Find another protector. Okay, understandable, but at the very least, you know, you're not going to turn us over. Thank you. Go. You can move freely in the camp and leave it whenever you wish. Thank you. Now I need to find a way to capture a pig. Okay, well, actually, we can leave, so let's go this way. That's the Carthaginian camp. We don't want to go that way. Um, this is back at Carthage. We don't want to go this way. Well, I guess the next option is go back and see if we die again. Let's go back to the gates. I hold it. I don't think we've gone this way. I don't think we have gone this way. <laughs> and you were saying that I couldn't handle my booze. You can't even handle the booze. What's this? Got an empty bottle. Whoa. Is that not what we wanted? Some of that, some of that, some of that, and that? Um, apparently not. White stuff? Not it. I don't know what we're supposed to do here. Or no, that was the way we came. That way? Maybe? Oh, hello. Oh, hello. I am Narhavis, chief of the Numidian cavalry. Why should I help you? You are neither a family member nor a friend. Um, yeah, let's offer our services again. No, Spendius. As soon as I've gotten the money I'm owed, I'll be leaving. As will all the other mercenaries. You will have to handle the Carthaginians on your own. Alrighty. Apparently he hasn't gotten his money yet. Hmm. I'm assuming we're trying to recreate that stuff. 
Because I knocked that guy out. I'm assuming it's one of those things where we... I'm going to take a guess and say that this is what we need to, like, capture pigs or something. <laughs> well, that certainly wasn't it. Can we put in, like, two dosages of that? We can. Um, blue. And then red. Mix it together, and what do you got? Not that. Uh, this may take a while. Oh, okay. We got it. Got the bubbling brew. Alrighty then, we've got a, a, gl a glowing bag of elephant's wine made out of 100% dead elephant. <laughs> Those are really into exotics. Okay, so this way to the... Okay, so what I'm thinking here, we take the elephant wine, the knockout juice, and we use it to catch pigs. Halt! Okay. No. You're sure? Halt! All right, we've been through this already. No. You're sure? Hmm. Maybe we give the wine to somebody. Maybe we give it to this guy. Maybe we give it to the dog. Not to you. Or... Or... We use it to jack a ride. Hey buddy, how do you like some elephant wine? Maybe not. Do we give it to the pottery dude? Maybe? No? Glue on pottery dude? No? Back, vermin, or I'll nail you to the ground. Hey, dude, you want some wine? No? Well, I'm running out of ideas here. Well, or maybe give it to him? No? Halt! Alrighty, I get it. No. You're... Alright, so I'm out of ideas. I'm going to have to cut and save it here for today. So I might have to look at look ahead to see how we get how we progress here. Um, but otherwise, I will see you. I will see you guys next time. In come on, I'll see you guys next time. In I'm trying to make a joke here. Come on. Oh, it did save. I'll see you guys next time.